Welcome back. I've been gone for a really long while, but this quarantine is getting to me. This is about the Yeezy 700 shoes. Uh, I believe it's the Yeezy 700 V3 and they're called Alva. So let's just get down to it. Um, you get like a cute box, right? This is my first pair of Yeezys, so I mean, they weren't that spendy, but I heard they ran out really quick. I wasn't sure about the sizing either, and I had three tabs open on my internet, like Google Chrome or whatever. And two of them were Adidas, and the third one was Yeezy Supply. And I was really trying to get the kids size, because they were a little um, cheaper than that adult size. And so I realized that they didn't come in three and a half in kids. I think, I believe they came in three, but they didn't come in three and a half. And I really wanted the three and a half in kids. And so Yeezy Supply was the first website to pull up um, the shoes that were adult size. And so I had to go with the adult sizing. Um, I wasn't sure about how you're basically supposed to get a half size bigger than you usually get because then they fit too tight or something but on the Yeezy Supply website they don't inform you that you need to go a half size bigger to the shoe so I just went with the size I usually get and I got a size 5 in men um, five in men is six in women, so, yeah, um, I'm these. So this is the shoe. Uh, there's this, I mean, I mean, I'm not an expert at this, this is like my first time doing it. So like there's this silicone and um, it's very, very padded. Um, I've never had a Yeezy shoe, so I just don't know. I didn't know what to expect. Um, so here's an up close look at the shoe. And then the opposite side. Um, and then instead of the sole right here is like super, super thick. I actually went for a walk earlier in these and my feet were sweating. I didn't have socks with them on when I went for a walk, so it could have just been that. I don't know. They just felt like super hot and sweaty and like, yeah. But that's besides the point. The shoe is amazing. It's good quality. Um, it's also glow in the dark, so like these outer shells kind of glow and well, Duh, they glow in the dark. Um, and then we have like a couple reflective thingies over here. Um, the shoelaces I haven't fully like uncovered. I don't care about like uncovering them because I don't want to like ruin them, I guess. And then the bottom has yellow um, thingies. I don't know what you call these. Um, it does not have boost, but it does have ortholite um, silicone thing inside of it. And it's more gray than black. I don't know, I love them. I just wanted to come on here and tell you guys about them because I've never owned a pair and I feel like you definitely get recognized wearing these shoes because, I don't know, they're super out there. I love them. Like, when you wear a Yeezy shoe like I feel like people know that you're wearing a Yeezy shoe because of how chunky they are and just the style in general so yeah I would definitely recommend, recommend buying these I got them for $200 I don't know how much they're going for now um, they're definitely going for more but yeah this is the shoe I love it my favorite sneaker I've ever 
purchase ever. I love it. Anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. And let me know if you like these shoes down in the comment area. Let me know if you think they're cool or you think they're not nice, like they're not your style. I would like love to know. Enough of me rambling. Please like and subscribe and turn on your post notifications if you want to know more. Yeah. Or no. Turn your post notifications on if you'd like to see more videos.